This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. For Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. I do appreciate all my Virgos out here. For my cross watches, this energy can be resonated. So just be a little aware that as you're tuning in, my name is D Reader, the Million Dollars here. For those of you that are new in, welcome to the Million Dollar Channel. Thank you, Earth Queen. I appreciate that. Thank you, Stephanie Love. What's going on for all my Virgos? Okay, so what we're going to be starting off with is Virgo has a new start and route of them. This is for my Virgos that don't even see this coming. It's time for you to step outside your comfort zone. So for a lot of my Virgos, in order to get to this new start, it's going to require you doing something that you wouldn't normally do. I'm seeing that your emotions could be running really high right now when it comes to a Gemini. For those of my Virgos that are dealing with a Gemini, do not let your emotions take over. Don't let this Gemini see you vulnerable. Don't let them see you sweat, Virgo. Um, for those of you that have a past with a Gemini, don't let this past hold you back. Some of my Virgos are single right now. You have a past with a Gemini. Don't let this stop you from moving forward for a lot of my Virgos. So for those of you that are dealing with a Libra, have a history with a Libra. I'm seeing there's a win-win outcome and forecast for you. We got so much Gemini energy showing up there. The answers that you need are coming. So for those of my Geminis that, ooh, excuse me. For those of my Virgos that are dealing with a Gemini or a Libra, I am seeing those answers come in for you. Even for those of you that didn't see it, a lot of you are waiting for some type of communication from this sign. A lot of you are wanting some type of answer. Some of you are dealing with a Scorpio right now. For my Virgos that are dealing with a Scorpio, this Scorpio can have a negative energy. So just be careful. Um, you're very close to achieving a goal and you don't want somebody's energy to throw you off from that goal. It looks like a Sagittarius is coming in for you. For those of you that are single, you could be getting to know a Sag right now or have a history with a Sag for some of my Virgos. Um, we have it's time to release negativity and hold your vision. So this is for my Virgos to not lose hope of what's next for them. We got a lot of big things coming in for Virgo, but Virgo has to see that their self. Believe in the impossible. You're really close to achieving your goal. This is for my Virgos that are working really hard towards a goal right now. I'm seeing this happen for you. Luck is on your side, Virgo, even if you don't see it. Luck is on your side. We got some cancer energy. We got you and your loved ones are safe. We got some Capricorn energy to end tough, tough cycle approaches. This is for my Virgos that feel like something keeps happening over and over and over again in their life, and they just can't move past it. Things are going to turn around for you. Thank you, Earth Queen. Thank you, Stephanie. Things are going to turn around for you, even if you don't see it, Virgo. A lot of you don't see this right now. A lot of you don't even realize that someone's missing you. This is a Taurus. We got secrets and discoveries. Somebody could be 22. So for a lot of our Virgos, this is something coming to light. This is something that you've been wanting. We've seen the answers that you need are coming. Now we got secrets and discoveries. This could be about another Virgo. For those of you that are dealing with another Virgo, we have the confidence and the power of healing. This is you healing from what this Taurus or this Gemini did to you. Somebody can have a seven-year-old. A lot of Taurus energy showing up. We got the hate nurtured with love. Be careful, Virgo. Someone could be betraying that they love you, painting this picture that they, you know, love you, but they could be secretly planning to stab you in the back. So be careful for some of my Virgos, especially if you're 35, dealing with someone 35. Somebody could be 21. This could be a Capricorn for some of you. We got the dreams of replaced lust. So for some of you, somebody is... It's like they hate you, but they're so sexually turned on by you. They can't get over you. For some of my Virgos out here, it's like they hate you, but it's like they want you sexually. So they're holding on to you. They don't want anybody else to have you sexually. This could even be somebody that you were dealing with at one point. This could be a Leo for some of you. Somebody can have a three-year-old. This could be a Libra. Somebody can have a nine-year-old. We got the truth behind illusions. So for those of my Virgos that are trying to understand why a situation went a certain way, there is truth and there is clarity coming behind this. Even for those of you that don't see it. We got some Aries energy. Somebody could be 30. Somebody can have an 11 year old. Okay, so we got the sharing the tales of love and romance. This is someone telling somebody about you. As you see, it's like she's laying there on the car. She's naked. She's feeling it. She's feeling real good. And she's just talking. She's just running her mouth. This could be masculine or feminine. This could go every way. You see somebody sitting there mad. It's like somebody's jealous. There could be a jealous energy around you, Virgo. Somebody could be jealous of your love life or jealous of the person that you're dating or the people that you attract. So just be careful for some of my Virgos out here. I am seeing you have a really honest and straight up conversation with someone will honestly discuss your feelings. For a lot of my Virgos, you're going to be having a very straight up conversation, very honest, just very upfront, letting somebody know pretty much how you feel and what it is. And this could actually be a good thing. Especially for those of you that are single right now and not really trying to settle. A lot of you like, I'm not settling. I want what I want. I'm not waiting. 
And divine timing is that love and your work in your love life right now. So it's worth waiting for. Just sit and wait and see what the universe has to offer for you. This could be really big for you, even if you don't see this right now for a lot of my Virgos. We got a Virgo that's single right now. Yeah, just, you know, sit back and relax. There's a lot of good things coming in for you. This is worth waiting for. Trust. Trust what the universe has to offer for you. Especially for my Virgos that are single. I am still doing five for five questions for Virgo. The cash app is D-E-E-F-O-N-D-E-L. The email is there, findelagmail.com. You can check out my bio or the description for more. For those of my Virgos that are getting to know someone right now and wondering if they should take it to the next level, I am getting it. This could potentially be your soulmate. You know, take what energy resonates and leave what doesn't. But I am seeing you get to know each other more to kind of decide that you'll use your discernment and be able to tell if this is the person that I am talking about. For those of you that are single, you do have new love and route of you. If you're not talking to someone now, someone could be approaching you very soon. I do appreciate all my Virgos. Thank you for tuning in.